of these smart people are saying that probably something serious is going to happen either later this year or early in 2015. Now, I'm not making things going kind to of happen, but these people are a lot smarter than I am, and they really are saying, get out of the market, get to things in your financial situation, because of course, this whole financial house of cards can come down. Yes, so no, things really haven't... The thing for people to understand is that these people who control our government are using the financial and military power of the United States to bring about a world government. And that is why we have 800 to 1,000 military bases throughout the world. Does anybody in their right mind honestly believe that we need 800 to 1,000 foreign military bases to protect the United States? This is why we have our troops stationed in 130 nations. Does anybody in their right mind believe we should need troops in 130 nations to protect the United States or an embassy in Baghdad with over 10,000 people in it to protect the United States? I mean, That's right. We, we have our troops permanently stationed in Germany, in Germany, 45,000 troops, 35,000 troops permanently stationed in Japan. 25,000 troops permanently stationed in Sydney in South Korea, about 10 or 11,000 permanently stationed in England and in Germany, in Italy. Basically, we occupy the world, and until people understand this, we're not defending America. We are pushing this globalist dream, but behind this are powerful spiritual forces, and that's what most people who talk about these things necessarily do not understand that this is an age-old program. It's been around for several thousand years. It's coming to a climax right now. We look and see things unfolding before our eyes, and we think this is what's happening. This is simply a manifestation of this age-old plan, and we're moving rapidly towards what I think is going to be the destruction of, of America, the destruction of civilization as we know. The First World War, they killed 22 million. Second World War, they killed 60 to 70 million. And they're planning on a Third World War. We know what they're planning. And I believe hundreds of millions, if not more, are going to die before this is over. Yes, absolutely. You know, what you're talking about in terms of arming both sides, feeding all this revolution, we just found out last week, at the end of the week, that Obama said he was going to send half a billion dollars to ISIS Today we see ISIS is crucifying eight anti-Assad fighters in Syria. So here they are, they're supposedly opposed to Assad, and yet they're crucifying anti-Assad fighters. And then this is the same group who's crucifying these other rebels that Obama is going to send half a billion dollars that he announced. Who knows how much money they've given these people covertly. But that just goes to show that the real goal is continued warfare continued chaos, continually taking everything down so they can destroy everything, so they can rebuild it as a one-world government, doesn't it? You're absolutely right. And they know that the only way that they're going to get the people of the world to go along with this is to have some terrible, horrible disaster. And I really believe it's coming, whether it's coming this year or next year or the year after that. I'm not going to give you a date, but I'm, I'm telling you that there's an awful lot that there's going to be a major economic collapse here very soon. And when World War III comes, I do not know, but I know they're planning on it. And with this, we're talking about not, uh, you know, uh, 50 or 100 million, but hundreds of millions of people are going to die. People say, we can't happen, but I really believe everything points that we're going to have a major nuclear war. And if you just simply look at what's going on over there in the Middle East, I mean, you've got China, and then he has nuclear weapons and, and Russia has nuclear weapons, and Pakistan has nuclear weapons. I believe Iran has nuclear weapons. I believe that Saudi Arabia has access to nuclear weapons. They don't already have them. Israel has nuclear weapons. And uh, the, the average individual really doesn't understand the implications. Well, Dr. Monteith, I think it's very clear that the Obama administration and the uh, people at the Pentagon are really trying to bring back the Cold War when we look at what's going on in Ukraine. 
We're going to be right back with Dr. Stanley Monteith. We're taking a look at what's happening not only at the border, but worldwide from a 50,000 foot view. What's really behind all of this? Stay with us. We'll be right back. What if there was a secret powder that, if consumed, would awaken your inner genius and raise your IQ? What if this powerful secret powder could not only make you smarter, but happier as well? What if the secret powder could lessen withdrawal symptoms from most addictions? Do you think that no such powder exists? Wrong. The secret powder does exist. Want to know its secrets? Then go to thesecretpowder.com and get your free sample today. Go to thesecretpowder.com and change your life forever. That's the sound of your door being kicked in by an intruder with a single kick. Criminals know that your wooden door frames are weak and your alarm system can't keep them out. That's the sound of the same door now protected by the door sentinel. Standard locks, deadbolts, and alarm systems can't prevent forced entry. Harden your door and door jam with a door sentinel. Protect your home now at MySafeDoor.com. Go to MySafeDoor.com for a special limited time offer. The door sentinel, your home's first line of defense. You are now in the crosshairs. The NSA and the FBI are treating you like a criminal and monitoring your every move. Ron Paul said recently, The evidence of the totalitarian nature of this government is on display undeniably every day. What's taking place right now is a coup and the destruction of the Constitution. But a friend and patriot has discovered a loophole. Find out about the NSA loophole before they shut it down at privacylockdown.com. That's privacylockdown.com. There's one major factor affecting the health of millions, and most people are completely unaware. Acid levels. Soda, meat, dairy, caffeine, and sugar can all lead to elevated acid levels in the body. AlkaVision Plasma pH Drops get the body's pH levels back in perfect balance. It's a holistic, natural, and powerful approach that will give you greater health, vitality, and zest for life. AlkaVision Plasma pH Drops. Visit ALKAVision.com. Alkalize your body. Supercharge your health at AlkaVision.com. It's been said, those who control the food control the people. Are you concerned about GMO foods making you sick and affecting your mind? Many people suffer from lack of energy, insomnia, loss of stamina, weight gain, and the inability to think clearly. Genetically modified crops, processed foods, and toxic chemicals can compromise your health and are silently destroying your digestive system, which accounts for 80% of your immune system. Take back control of your health with Pro-EM1 Probiotic from Terragenics. Pro-EM1 Probiotic helps protect your body against irritable bowel syndrome, constipation, Crohn's disease, celiac disease, diabetes, the common cold, and much more. And including a powerful probiotic like Pro-EM1 as part of your daily routine puts you back in control and prevents you from becoming a mindless zombie manipulated by the pharmaceutical and GMO agendas. Call Terraganics at 866-369-3678 or visit Terraganics.com. T-E-R-A-G-A-N-I-X.com. Extend your life with Extend Ovite. Hey, neighbor, what are you doing digging? You had a heart attack last year. Oh, I know. I was told no more hard labor. Then why are you digging? Well, I've been taking Extend Ovite. It's been approved to help my heart. Extend Ovite? Is that a new drug? No, not a drug. It's uh, more like an herbal combination made from garlic and cayenne. Herbal? How can that help? Well, actually, we've taken herbs for thousands of years, and Extendivite is doing the job for me. Does your doctor know about Extendivite? Yeah, my doctor knows, and he said it seems to be working for you, so don't stop taking it. I feel great taking Extendivite. I don't want to stop. To order, call 1-877-928-8822. That's 1-877-928-8822, or visit our website at heartdrop.com. Extend your life with Welcome back to the Alex Jones Show. I'm David Knight, your host, and I have with me on the phone Dr. Stanley Monteith of RadioLiberty.com. Uh, Dr. Monteith is a physician and someone who deeply cares about liberty, who also understands what the big picture is, as we see the massive contradictions and hypocrisy at what is being done at the border versus what's being done to Americans within the country. As we talked about yesterday on the show, as you see Texas towns 
losing, going bankrupt, essentially, and losing their security, we see that the federal government is doing nothing about that. They're not sending any aid to those towns. Instead, what they're doing is they're sending half a billion dollars to ISIS, ISIS, and to Syrian rebels. We see that Obama is sending the CIA to the UK to probe the terrorist breeding grounds there, and yet the borders are completely open. At the same time, they talk about the dignity of children and people who are crossing the border. They offer us in the United States within our borders, at our airports, at our bus stations, train stations, on our highways, they offer us no dignity. Instead, we get the TSA pat down. This is all being done by the same organization. Homeland Security has control of internal security, is federalizing the police at the same time that they stand down at the border. Dr. Monteith, do you think this kind of contradiction, this kind of hypocrisy has a chance of waking people up? Well, I think people have to be able to see things clearly. I mean, so much of what goes on doesn't make any sense. Why would we be allowing all these children coming across the border, and then when they cut across the border, sending them back again, we're looking for places to send them where they can be looked after until they can be put into homes. Why would we be doing that? Because the major agenda of the subversive group that controls our government. And basically, nobody wants to say this. There's a subversive group that controls our government with it. As an intention of America, wants to destroy the sovereignty of this nation. These people should be tried, arrested, and then sent to prison for their crimes against humanity. But this subversive group uh, basically, uh, you know, certainly uh, is goal is to uh, unite all of North America. In other words, uh, unite Mexico, or unite the, the United States and Canada and the United States of North America. It is part of this subversive plan to bring about a world government, the United States of Europe, the United States of North America, the United States of Central America, the United States of South America. But the average American the average American just wants to live and be allowed to live. He doesn't understand this subversive group that kills people, they, or they have their assassins. And I know anybody who has any questions, I have a four CD set gift from my ministry. It's called Debbie and Assassins. Where I can be interviewed, you can actually hear my interviews with government assassins who've been assigned to kill people. Well, you talk about government assassins. We just had an article that uh, came out yesterday in the New York Times. Well, they're talking about these Blackwater mercenaries in Iraq threatening State Department investigators and saying, this is Iraq. I can kill you if I want to, and nobody can or will do anything about it. And when the investigator went to the embassy staff there, they said they backed up Blackwater. These are mercenaries who are being paid billions of dollars and told that they can kill anybody that they wish, including... State Department investigators, and shortly after that, they killed 17 Iraq civilians in a city square. Yeah, but people ignore the fact that they kill people here. This is a four CD set. You can actually hear my, my interview with four with a, a two of a government assassins. One of the men who actually tracked down the assassin who was actually paid to kill General Patton. Mm. I mean, we're talking about people being killed in America. This is not imaginary. Yes. And anybody would like to get that for CD set, we put a plug in, 1-800-544-8927. 1-800-544-8927. The four CD set, Deadly Assassin, this is what's really going on today. And the fact that most people don't want to think about this, we just want to be left alone. Let us live our lives. Let us, I mean, we have the most wonderful society in the world. I mean, where else in the world would a hundred and... 48 million people be getting some sort of a government check of one sort or another, but there's a little over, only a little over 300 million people. People don't understand this is all coming to a very, very rapid end. It's yes. all part of a plan laid out by two communists, Boward and Pivot. Yes. Boward and Pivot, they wrote this up in the 1960s. They said, we'll simply bend America into oblivion, we'll bankrupt us. And basically Hang on right there, Dr. Monteith. We've got to come up to a break. We're going to talk about Cloward and Piven, and we're going to talk about Obama's FEMA Corps. What's happening? Why are they bringing so many children in? There's a reason for that as well, I believe.
Stay with us. We'll be right back with Dr. Stanley Monteith. We're on. 